before I came to IIT, I believe science was a very difficult subject for women. But coming to IIT, I see that um, IIT encourages a lot of women to go into science due to the policies that have been laid down and also the facilities here in IIT are gender friendly. Even coming into IIT, you see that a lot of positions have been held by women and, are, and they are doing a great job handling those positions. Because of that, I know that as a woman, I can be whatever I want to be. 2016, I served in IIT Kano under the supervision of Dr. Booker. So before I got my acceptance letter, he was skeptical. We should be able to go to the field. We should be able to work under the hot sun. We should be able to take data. I'm very happy I exceeded his expectation. So after my NYSC, he encouraged me to go for my master's. And I did my master's under the supervision of Professor Michael Abertin. And um, IIT has given me the platform to grow. I've learned skills, I've attended conferences, and I was privileged to attend the last uh, conference uh, that took place in the United Kingdom at Kew's Garden. Thank you, Dr. Booker. Thank you, Professor Mike Abertin. Thank you, IIT. My belief is that women have a vital role uh, to play in advancing science, and it is so essential that uh, to continue the advocate for gender equality and creating an environment where women can thrive and then contribute their full potential to the scientific community. The role women played are so germane in science before coming and then when I came to ITA, I saw the role women played in IT and I saw I was so marveled that wow, that what a man can do, a woman can even do it far better. And it was so amazing seeing them performing those roles. My advice to women that are looking to build a career in science are to pursue their passion, build a strong academic foundation, seek mentorship and support, learn how to be bold and confident. They should also learn to embrace challenges because science can be challenging at times. So with this, they can make an impact in science. IIT has invested in my academics by providing me with a platform to grow academically and morally, network and build relationships with um, scientists in agriculture. I remember coming to IIT in 2018 as a naive youth copper, not knowing what I was going to do after my four years in school and after my one year compulsory youth service score. I had the opportunity to um, take trainings in molecular biology techniques plant pathology, tissue culture, and other areas. Having been under the tutelage and um, counseling of both female and male scientists in IIT, I've been able to identify my area of career interest and achieve my goal as a young woman in science. First of all, I would say embrace your curiosity and passion. Science, is, uh, science runs on the why and how, so you want to always be asking yourself those questions and. You don't want to be scared, believe in yourself, believe you can do it, and you follow your passion. Uh, secondly, I would say you develop your skills in communication and research. So you want to understand how um, experiments are being designed, you want to understand data analysis, and at the same time, you want to be able to communicate those results to the outside world. Thirdly, I would say you have a good work-life balance. It's very important. A lot of people look at sciences as a very serious discipline but it's good as women to have a good work-life balance and take time to enjoy themselves and look for other things they enjoy outside of work. And lastly, I'll leave you with this quote by the Nobel Peace Prize winner from Pakistan, Malala. As she mentioned, we cannot all succeed if half of us is held back.